Hello viewers, welcome to Ultimate Gaming Guide. I'm Tanver, how are you all doing today? I hope everyone's doing well. So if you own an ASRock B450M Still Legend motherboard, uh, you have probably encountered some sort of instability issue while you are trying to overclock your RAM. So in this video, we'll try to fix that problem. Okay, so first of all, uh, if you uh, go to, let's go to the ASRock um, website and if you look at the specification for our B450M Still Legend motherboard, you can see here that uh, supports, it says supports DDR4 3533OC. So it's supposed to uh, support 3533 frequency uh, in overclocking mode. But in reality, that is not the case. I tried uh, like uh, two different RAM and in the, with this motherboard uh, and try to overclock it and try to like use XMP profile on it. Uh, so this is the first RAM that I tried with. This is the XPG RAM A -Data, from A Data, and uh, this RAM is uh, uh, supports rated as 3200 megahertz. So when I try to use this RAM and load the XMP profile with this motherboard, uh, it on uh, my Windows on boot at all. And then I try increasing the voltage up to 1.4 volt, and uh, Windows would load, but later it would crash again. So uh, it was no help. Then I tried these a uh, um, little bit more powerful G Skill um, G Skill ribs are RAM, and these are rated as like 3600 megahertz. So, uh, but this motherboard supports up to like 3533. So I tried the 3533 megahertz with this RAM, and Windows only load up load like at all and then I tried increasing the voltage and still it only load up then finally I had to remove the CMOS battery and uh, uh, for to make the windows load again and make the windows boot up again so and in in each every cases like when you like try to overclock and your overclock fails uh, the, the frequency will load to like the like a, in a default frequency for your RAM so uh, the default frequency for these RAMs were like 2667, so it would go back to revert back to that default frequency. The 2667 is very low by today's standards, so after doing some research, after doing some tweaking, I was able to figure out what the sweet spot for this uh, motherboard is. So let's do it right now. So let's cross out of that. Let's go to BIOS. Let's uh, restart my computer. And when it well, is restarting, keep pressing the delete key. Okay, so after you are into the BIOS, uh, go to OC Tweaker, and what are you gonna do? You're gonna load the XMP profile. So instead of just just if it's this normally stays on auto, so you wanna just come and load XMP setting, select the XMP setting. So and uh, depending on your RAM, you might see something different. And when you load the XMP profile, it will set the frequency at 3200 megahertz, and it will load. Uh, uh, set the viewing voltage at 1.35. So what do you do? That's this is not gonna work. So what do you have to do? You have to lower the frequency a little bit. So the sweet spot for this motherboard is uh, 3066. Anything more than that, your system will crash again. So after you set it to 3066, go to your uh, save and exit or press like F10 and Load into Windows. So we load into Windows. So if now if I press the Control Alter Delete key and click the Task Manager and click the Performance tab, then the Memory tab, you can see the RAMs are running at 3066 megahertz, uh, which is a lot better than 2667 megahertz. Uh, and that's how you fix the RAM instability issue in. Asrock B450M Still Legend Motherboard. I hope this video was helpful to you. Uh, if you find this video helpful, do like and subscribe. Uh, thank you so much for watching. You have a great day.